morning, it is 10 past 6 in the morning. Um, I'm going to a spin class this morning at 7 o'clock. I thought that I would just take you through my entire day and what it looks like um, to study as a mature student, just in case this is something you're thinking of. It is quite full on <laughs> um, and it takes a lot of self-discipline in some cases, but I will show you what a normal day looks like for me. Every day is different, so I can't say it looks like this every day. Some days it's busier than others. This is a medium quiet day, I'd say. Quiet to medium day. Um, but it would be quite hard to update and film on one of my busier days. So I'm going to finish my lemon water. Um, I'm not sure I can really face eating, but it's a cycle class, so I maybe should try and find something to eat. Um, otherwise I'll be running off nothing, which isn't ideal. I forgot to put my laptop on charge last night, so that is a good thing about waking up super early. I can do that now and hopefully, in fact it should definitely be charged by the time I need it um, when I come home for uni today. And I also did my lemon wrong this morning. I had it upside down and wondered why it took so long to dribble down. <laughs> Get start to the morning, right? <laughs> than it was when I went out. <laughs> um, excuse this, I am just home from cycle. Um, it started raining on the way back but I was so sweaty that I actually didn't care and I didn't even bother putting my head up. <laughs> I actually maybe could have done without going. Um, my energy levels just weren't there. I'd love to go back to bed for a nap and technically I actually have the time to before my lecture. However, I have a report to write for work, um, I need to do an update of a child's speech for their school, so I will be working on that rather than sleeping. <laughs> but I need to shower and I need coffee to survive it. Turner mature student widening participation individual um, is time management. <laughs> so it prioritizing tasks, prioritizing your workload, it never ends. So I had a spare half hour and I had to decide whether I was going to finish a work thing or whether I was going to look at um, a lecture that I missed because of flat hunting at the moment because we have to leave this gorgeous flat. I'm so upset about it. It's such a beautiful place. But well, it happens. Um, yeah, so I was like, okay, what do I do with that half an hour? Do I work or do I study? Really, I want to sleep, <laughs> but that's not gonna happen. I'm currently hugging the radiator because I'm so cold. Anyway, <laughs> um, I need to get to uni now. I'm going to pack my bag once I peel myself away from the radiator and I'll walk to uni and I have a psychology lecture at, well, whatever the next half hour is. <laughs> Help! And I'm ready to go! lunch with a friend and then I 
we went for coffee <laughs> and then we went to the library for a bit and now I'm walking to work in the pouring rain. <laughs> the joys! No, it's actually been a really nice day. I feel like my energy's lifted up a bit and I'm looking forward to work because I really enjoy my job. I'm literally just in the door and I'm thinking about making dinner. Um, first one in makes dinner. So, which is a good deal, but I'm the first one in tonight, so I'll have to think about that. Um, I had to stop at the shop and get a few bits and bobs because we haven't really had time to do food shopping this week. That's one thing about um, two mature students in the same flat is that both of us are always either working or studying or trying to have somewhat of a life. Um, so Graham plays golf and I'll go to yoga or go for coffee with friends etc. Um, so it's quite hard to get that. I think this is the first week we've gone with no shopping. <laughs> so I've just picked up a couple of bits and bobs. We can either go tonight, I do have some uni work to do. Um, we can either go tonight or uh, I don't know, we'll just see. But anyway, so I'm going to make dinner, then I'll either go shopping with Graham or I will do some uni work, although my brain obviously isn't working very well if I can't come up with basic words and thoughts. So we'll see how that goes. because it was very rushed so um, I got in and I made dinner and then after dinner we went straight to the supermarket and did our weekly shop finally <laughs> like two weeks later than we should have um, so we did that and then straight after that I just had to run in get changed and then I had a yin yoga class booked because um, it just helps me chill out at night my brain finds it quite hard to switch off so that is what a quiet to medium day looks like for me at the moment during the week. Obviously weekends are different, um, but if being a student is something that you're thinking about whilst also working, this is roughly what you should expect. Um, there are some days where, you know, I'm in uni for three or four hours and then go straight to work. Um, obviously it depends what your hobbies are and what you like to do aside from that, which I think is an important thing. I just really want to highlight that, that if you're working and studying at the same time, you should definitely have something in your life that you do just for yourself. Um, so for me, that is some form of exercise. That's something I do for myself. It just so happens that it also falls into the self-care category, but it is something that I just quite like to do that doesn't involve studying. I also um, quite like to draw, which has nothing to do with academia or my working life. So yeah, I think that is something that everyone should take into consideration. Everyone, no matter what their life is like, even if you're not studying, make sure you have something that's just yours that you can do quite a lot, maybe once a day, maybe not every day, but you know, something that you can do just for yourself, because got to embrace that self-love, right? <laughs> got to take care of ourselves. Anyway, I did not manage to get some of my reading done, so I need to do that, but to be honest, I'm quite tired, um, so I'm going to get up extra early in the morning to catch up on the readings that I've missed out, um, so that will be the start to my day tomorrow. <laughs> Lucky me! I did sign up for this. I'm doing this for me, right? I hope this style of video was helpful in one way or another, or at least you enjoyed some of it. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!